Good afternoon and welcome to day two of the Predator World 8 Ball Championships at the Convention Centre here in San Juan, Puerto Rico. Petri Makinen and Masato Yoshioka are up next. Your referee for this one is the world, the world famous, everyone knows this man, John Lehman. And your timekeeper on this one and on the shot clock is Lance Bromelin. It's WPA rules, it's a race to eight, it's cool shots. And with me, where we just moved a few yards along to the other side of the arena, Marcus Shamet. Hi, Marcus. Hi, Mark. So, big match here. Contention of Japan. Yeah, well, you were talking about Mac Mackinnon's big break as we see the four railer mm -hmm. go in. Yeah, Mackinnon has got a huge break, which is going to be very important. Mm. in this particular format but that looked pretty good as well made a ball so cast your expert eye across this nine foot predator table and tell us what you see yeah um, not a real easy shot on the, on the solids so he's probably going to select play the 13 on the side maybe the man from Japan And there's quite a few Japanese players here in this eight ball tournament, isn't there? It's obviously big in Japan. Yeah, Japan got a, a lot of players. They, used, they had a tournament there. I think it was 2001. You know how many players? They, there was like a, they put out in a one time big event. First prize was 150,000, I think, US. Uh, FM won, he beat Nils in the final. It was 750 players. Whoa. I reached the last 16. I lost to to Yang 13-12. Remember that? Yeah, you Paul players amaze me. You know, remember every score, don't you? I bet you can tell me which ball you missed as well. No, I didn't miss any ball that that, oh, that match. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. Or lack of misses. Mm. <laughs> oh yeah, big mistake here. No, it was um, um, it was in Tokyo the event. 700 players, Mark. It's unbelievable. Played in f few different pool rooms, you know, like the early stages, and then we moved into a big convention center for, for the for the top. I think it was 128 players. So There's a shot clock in use. 30 seconds. 60 seconds after the break. All ball fouls. Three foul rule. Jumps are allowed as well, so we might see a little bit of jumping, although you don't see a lot of that in eight ball, do you? No, more in nine ball. Doesn't come up often. In. Nicely done. Petri from Finland, from the Iceman's territory. Iceman, it's Mika Imanen. Mika Imanen, he's playing in this as well. We've got young Riku Rompanen as well, 14 years old. He won his first match yesterday. He's playing in the juniors. He played in the Puerto Rico Open as well. He's playing in everything. When you're that age, all you want to do is play pool, right? Yeah, nothing else. <laughs> is he banking this? No. 14. Oh, he could make it. I didn't realise he could make it. Nicely done. Yeah, it was important. He didn't overhit that, wasn't it? Because he didn't want to tie up that 15. Yeah, he's trying to figure out the easiest path for him to get to that eight ball. Pet three. I think a good idea would be to leave the nine for last. Yeah, I wouldn't mind leaving this one either. What's that, the ten? Mm. Get straight on it. Or straight-ish. his plan as well either dead straight or a decent angle but you won't want to be running around the cue ball around the table I wouldn't have thought off the 10 yeah you this looks good it. this looks Oops. perfect this looks absolutely perfect wants it to run a little bit more oh, I 
half. He's finished straight on this. That's a great shot, Marcus. Mm. He went on a slight angle. I don't know if he landed. Draw straight back. I know he's got to go forwards now. Just the wrong angle then. Oh, lots of inside. Lots of left hand. Wants a bump on the jaw. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Otherwise, it would have been perfect in it if he didn't hit the point. Point Dexter. Just got a little bit mm. too much on it. He hangs his head and she. <laughs> yeah. It's eight ball to win the first game. Great shot. Nice in shot. it goes. Impressive clearance then. And now we're going to get to see the Petri Mackinnon break, and he's well known for his break. Oh, he hits him real hard. Going to get some pop. Did you used to pop the cue ball? Yeah. What about, did you ever park the cue ball? <laughs> well, in eight ball, the most important is to, to hit him really square. You know, it's not less important. It's important to pop him as in tumble. You need to looking for a, you're looking for a position for the one, right? But in April, you guys, you got to hit him a square and as hard as possible. He's hope you make a ball. <laughs> that? There he is, sponsored by Town. Next others. How many times have we seen the back of John Lehman's bed? Hi. <laughs> How long have we seen the back of his head? His back is probably the most famous, famous back, back in the world. <laughs> <laughs> no one knows him from the front. <laughs> they only know his back. That's John Lehman. Yeah. A happy chappy with the racky. They should make, the paint, they should make a painting and, and put it in Amsterdam Builders in New York. A back of John Lehman. Yeah, that's a good with idea. With a ponytail. Yeah. So here, first look at Petris' break. Pay attention. Oh, he's made a ball. He lost the cue ball just, though. Oh, it's not bad, Marcus, is it? I see what you mean. Could have jumped off the table there. Just caught the yeah. rail in the right position. Lots going on here in the convention centre. So, a super, super easy out for Petra here. He's going to select the high, uh, the low balls, excuse me, the solids. Trying to play the four or sooner or later, break up. Can he run into it here? He can, but he don't need to because the four passes. Oh, it does pass, yeah. does it? He's just making up his mind. I wonder what's, what's his... Uh, Concern. Don't know. He's playing that four ball now. Is he to get the one out? Is that what the plan is? Play the four to draw onto the. Oh no, he's playing the bank. Oh, I don't understand this shot. Nicely done, though. He does, though. That <laughs> solved the whole game. Yeah, I mean, if you like banking and you're good at it, then it's just, just like playing a a straight in pot, right? Mm. That's the thing about April. Nobody can really tell you what's the right or wrong shot as long as you commit to commit to it. That's what he's done there. I think it'd be boring if we were all the same, mm. wouldn't it? All running the same patterns every time. <laughs> We'd be out of a job.
Petri making sure he gets correct angles here. Ah, uh, he he hangs his head in shame. I don't know. He landed straight there. <laughs> that looks as it all, huh? Yeah, he's, he's a bit of a touchy shot as well if he's finished straight because he's going to have to leave a, a bigger cut on the seven ball than he would have wanted. Mm. He's got to judge this right. He's playing a kill shot here. Or kill the cue ball. Played it with lots of mm -hmm. right hand just to send it wide. <laughs> Didn't like that. He's never happy, is he? No. <laughs> uh, he'll make it. I did see him smile once. <laughs> Make sure you don't scratch with the cue ball, though. Okay, good. Yeah, good shot. 2-0. So we're going to get to see another break. Well, we had a six-pack from Ko Pin Yi. <laughs> In the last one, he had a five-pack yesterday in his first round match. Surely he's got to be considered <laughs> as one of the favourites for this. He's breaking like a monster, apparently. And when you're running five and six-packs, Marcus... There is an eight soon coming. We haven't seen one, but it's coming, right? Yeah, I think so. Your little face lights up when you when you talk about eight packs. <laughs> <laughs> well, everybody says it's not going to happen, and I said it will happen, so let's see. Jesus Atencio is in action against Hiroka Masato. They're 1-1 at the moment. Schneider... And Stephen Holem is in action from Canada. They have won one. His mum will be very pleased. He turned up yesterday to, to play and didn't have the correct clothes. He actually had to go out and buy some new clothes because he didn't have any black pants. And his mum messaged me last night and she was very worried about him. She said, why, why did my son not turn up? What's happened to his match? And... I had to say that, well, tell her what happened. <laughs> tell her. He's lost his pants. <laughs> oh. Made Another ball made. Made one. Well, looking around very quickly. Stripes look pretty good. There was more movement than power from Matt Petri. Still made a ball, though. That's the most important in this game. He's got this sh shot in the side to start, and it's much like the one of the first few shots he had before, isn't it, when he cut that really s slow ball into the side. Yeah, let's see what... The 1-5 is tied up. That's the reason why he's doubting not to take the solids. I think his stripes is the way to go. Making sure he gets the. Mm -hmm. Well played. Judged that nicely. Probably his next ball, isn't it? Yeah, I think One he's going to try and play. Probably wants to leave the 15 for last here in order for him to get an easy position for the 8. Done. Yeah, that's good. Lots of right hand spin on the cue ball. Teasing it down for the 11. This is looking good now from Petri. Nine ball. It's all about angles here, Mark. Eight bullets, huge the angles. You always want to give yourself like angles going using the rails in eight bullets is big. 
you don't want to leave yourself too straight in order for you to travel with the cue ball towards the next ball you're looking to play shape for. in the corner I think I thought he was going to try to come down for the side pocket yeah I think I saw in a camera angle earlier on it goes past the 5 and the 7 in between the 5 and 7 he needs to otherwise he's he's come with a really good shot could even draw it straight over and play it in this left hand side pocket couldn't he yeah, he goes in the right hand side pocket we miscued well he's miscued what a time for a miscue no. Look at this tip. 15 in the side. He's going to let the cube loose. <coughs> yeah, will he go into the five? Oh, he played it, played it off. Well, beautifully mm. on the eight ball, but he's left a chance. Oh, he played it off the two. Yeah. yeah. Doing some work on his tip in the corner there. So Yoshiwaka with opportunity. Well. Oh, he's just called the ref in to have a look. Watch over this ball. Thought he wanted to fight him. Young. Look at him looking. He needs to break up the one five. Yoshioka has his problems. Problem balls. to his advantage now. The man of the moment is on the table too, there next to us, uh, Mark Carlo Biado. Yeah, he's 2-1 up against another Japanese player. Yoshihiro Kitatani. Great to see so many countries from around the world represented. I think there's 44 countries. You've been to more countries than that, though, haven't you? Yeah, you I said about know. 50, didn't you? Around 40, 50 or something, yeah. <laughs> Anywhere you haven't been which you really want to go to? Oh, yeah, of course. Um, I don't know, actually. I've been to a lot of places, but usually when you play tournaments, it's like you don't have much time to um, look around and enjoy the countries yeah japan is definitely on my bucket list mm, you love that it's a really nice country love japanese food i know that so this eight ball to open up his account in this year's predator world eight ball championships from the convention center here in Sam one yeah. and in it goes and we're gonna go but we'll be back soon
welcome back. We're ready to rock and roll, rack and roll. Masato Yoshioka. See his break. Nicely done. Does he make any balls though? No. Nothing doing. Mm. Plenty of movement. Watch the back leg come up. Hey, up it goes. <laughs> Well, he broke him good. Still isn't making a ball. It's tough to fade. Petri. Paul fans waking up now as well. The arena beginning to fill up we had some great crowds here yesterday didn't we mm. huge and look at the players we had we had Jason Shaw in here yesterday we had Joshua Filler we had Shane Van Boning names don't get any bigger than that in no. Paul it's the world top class 128 of them oh Going for this $60,000 first prize, 40 runner-up, 20 semi-finalists, 10 quarter-finalists. I'm going to give you some homework, Marcus. I want you to write down your picks for the quarter-finals. Who's going to be in the last eight? That's what I'm going to ask you when we commentate next. So that's your homework. Mm -hmm. If you don't have it, you're going to get detention. <laughs> Morning. Written wrong, warning. Do it again, it's expulsion. Nicely done. Making quick work of this rack. This is probably the trickiest shot he's got to come now. And goes the longer extension. We're going to leave the one for last. There's a few players from New Zealand here as well. I think I've seen four ah, of them a little short. Oh. this week. Falling a little bit down the line here. We, you have to use the bridge, which, which you can make. Sometimes you can make an error of using it. I think it's fine though. Down goes the one. Longer April than he wanted. Well, out of the 16 tables we've got going at the moment, Marcus, four of them, that's a quarter, 25% of them are from Japan. Mm -hmm. Nicely done again. Three one up. Race to eight. Petri Mackinnon. Yeah, he must have worried for a second. <laughs> it looked like he might have scratched off the nine in the side there, but he was okay. Caught it full enough. Lots going on today. Matches for you. We started at ten. We've got this one midday, we've got two, we've got five, seven and nine, Marcus. Busy day mm, today. Big day, yeah. Big, big day on the second day. And it's just going to get better and better the nearer the end of the tournament we get. We've also got three junior finals that we're going to be showing at some point. I'll let you know when. 
coming up on this table next. Well, you've got a nice one next. You've got your old friend up next, Marcus. Ralph Suke will mm. be in action against Conrad Musician. Mm. It's a big match. And on the other table, Robbie Capito from Hong Kong will be against, well, the, the second Austrian on table two this morning. It will be Mario He, mm -hmm. Super Mario, the panda. Breaking off is Petu. That's his nickname, Petu. Petri Mackinen, big, big breakup. Crushes them. Oh, he gave him a smack. Nothing, though. Wow. That's a dry break. Well, he's looking, standing at the table, thinking, how on earth? How has nothing gone there? Mm -hmm. Look at the look at that ball spinning, that one on, on the rail, look. Still going. Look at those kids there in the crowd. They're, <laughs> they're like Super Mario. What do you call it? They're dressed as uh, Super Mario Bros. The game. Oh, I don't That's see, nice. I can't see them at the moment. There they are. Look at that. Hey, <laughs> hello, Enjoying Super the game. Mario. <laughs> 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 Bit young Lovely. to have moustaches, yeah. aren't they? <laughs> Do you reckon they're real? <laughs> it's twins, probably. That's brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> That's what we need, a bit more fancy dress, at, oh, like yeah. they do at the old uh, Moscone Cup. Best dressed. Sure, they, they will be up there with a the price. Nice shot there, opening everything up. Mm. What if the seven goes in the corner? I, I would like if for him to shoot it, if it goes. They will open up the whole game for him. It goes in the side for sure. He's not happy though. Not happy camper. Oh, he's got the two. Nicely done. Yeah, not easy to control. So deep in the pocket, well done. Still work to do though. Let's see if he tries to come for the one. Position, position shooting for the one ball. Because he needs to sort that seven ball out, Mark. Swing it round two rows between the eight and the 13. Good call. No, this is the, the key shot in this rack. See, I like coming off the rail into the set, into that. 11-7 here. Catch the seven would be nice. Thing is, when you start moving balls this late, things can go wrong. You should always have a, a, a another ball guaranteed to get insurance yeah. ball. Yeah. Yeah, I like that though because we can. He'll have the three if he catches the seven. May even end up on the seven. Just like that. Nicely done. Perfect. Yeah, it really was. Still Caught it perfectly. Still got some work to do though, Mark. A couple more good position shots. Looks like he's going to try to play position for the four here. Out. Yeah, that's nice. Got to be careful again, though. He's got a big angle on this four ball. Biardo, 4 1 up. I feel sorry for yeah. you as well, mate. Not nice seeing people miss a ball, especially by that much. Overcut, overcut it big time. Yeah, just thinking about the cue ball, I guess. Was worried about the position mm. for the next ball. Hadn't really made up his mind, maybe. 
So Mackinnon with a chance to extend his lead. Petri's going to be happy with it, this opportunity. Like picking sitting ducks. When, when your opponent misses the last ball or they the yeah. ball before. Yeah. Like shooting fish in a barrel. Wants it off that rail a little bit. Ronnie O'Sullivan was playing some eight ball for a while. When we had a, we had an IPT tour in Vegas. I guess his eight ball's pretty good. Played decent. He, c he couldn't really compete with us, the best players. But he was pretty good. So I've got a question for you. Why snooker is, you know, it's a more much more difficult game than pole, right? Well, you got bigger why it is or why, it, you think? Because well, what do you, what do you mean? It's a bigger, it's a bigger table. Yeah. There's more pockets balls on the pockets are smaller. The cloth is completely it different. It reacts different. Exactly. Which yeah. way you're going up mm. and down the table? Yeah. Just the, and the sheer size of it as well, you know, and the fact that you must go for a colour after every red. So mm -hmm. you know, it's it's a difficult game, right? So why don't we see snooker players coming and being great pool players? talking about well, I know that has happened Kelly Fisher Alison Fisher do you think it's just a time of Tony dedicating? Drago Tony Drago Tony Drago he's good um, yeah um, well obviously I mean they Chris Mellin obviously they got their own tour in, in snooker it's a lot of money in their tour so why should they change and mess up and try to play something another game yeah that's one of the reasons that's my thinking as yeah. well but when IPT came along, it was big money. All of a sudden, they tried to, few of them tried uh, the luck at the IPT. So in it goes then. Now 4-1 to Mackinnon. Things looking just a little bit. The pool is, di is difficult in, an, in another way, you see. It's, it's difficult as far as... Oh, of course, I'm not saying know, it's yeah. easy. No, no, I'm saying we're comparing the games. I mean, pool is harder to play safety because you really got to lock the, the players up, right? That means it's more difficult. And, and also you got to master the break in pool. If you don't master the break, you've got no shot winning tournaments. If you don't yeah. have a big break in eight, this World Championship 8 pool, you're like in a dare inside with lions. They're going to eat you, eat you up sooner or later. <laughs> so Well, he broke dry last time. See him put even more power, you think? <laughs> if it's, is it even possible? If he does, I'm ducking. I'm getting out of the way because I'm right in the firing line. Watch out, people. Three ball, corner. Yes, three ball. And another one, 14, I think it was, in this bottom right-hand corner. It would be nice if they have this, like a speed gun. Master, We should have a speed gun when they break now in, in April. Master the, the power. would be nice. Yeah, they actually have that break speed championships at the Derby City Classic every year, which is always fun. And you choose four or five players. They get the speed gun up. And see who can break the hardest. Let's see I think the record's 38 miles an hour. Let's see if our uh, our head man Javier can organize a speed monitor yeah. so we can get get the power from these bre breaks. Come on, Javier! Put your hand in your pocket. It would be nice to see him. Buy us a speed gun or just steal one from the police <laughs> as you're passing. <laughs> <laughs> Stick your hand out the window. You know what Predator used to have uh, on their app? You can go to the app and measure your, your power of your brake before, years ago. Really? I don't, yeah, I don't know if they still have it. Looking at the shot, 
watch the clock here. <laughs> yeah, it would be nice to see to measure the power of these brakes. Because Stroke is in slow. You know what it is, Mark? The players are putting... They know they need a big, big break in order for them to make a ball on the break. They, can, they cannot just control the cue ball. And we're going to see some hard breaks here this week. He's already seen a couple of balls fly off the table from the break. Tim De Reuter was one of them. And Jason Shaw done one as well, was it, yesterday, I think? Reese, Reese was breaking real hard as well. Tyler Styler broke really well the other day. Yeah, huh? Tyler played really well, yeah. I don't know if he played that good, but he broke really good. Yeah. His cue ball wasn't good, was it? Nice shot. Yeah, that's a good shot. Is that a line on this, though? He's got to kill it. Can he Can he hold the shot for the seven here? I think he's trying to come oh, across the he face he of wanted that, it, wasn't yeah. he? Yeah, he wanted it. Doesn't have much time. That's why he's kind of back and forth. You just play it with left, just spin it round. Mm. Nicely done. Nice touch for a big man. For a man with such a big break, he's Fla also got a nice little touch. The flying fin. It's the Midas touch at the moment. Like needs it. a bit of luck here. Needs a like bit of luck it. here. He's hangs his head oh in shame. Oh dear, he's gonna have to jump this. Well, we spoke about <laughs> not seeing many jump shots. We're gonna see one here. Eight ball corner puck. He's a straight in. But he needs it's to not a difficult jump, is it? It's a nice one of them nice distance ones. This is one for the for the show reel coming up. The really good jumpers they probably do make this eight out of ten times. I think. Yeah. Huh? Wow. Missed it. Disgusted. So opportunity here, big opportunity. Oh, what a chance. Disappointment, frustration. Could have finished worse though. What has he done here? Surely that's not where he wanted to land. Plan B, he's going to have to play the 13, I think. Uh, There's just the Mario just Brothers. Goes, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just goes. Nice, nice cue in. Threw it nicely. Yoshioka. Lots Yoshioka. of other games going on around the room. If you want to keep in tune with what's going on and watch them, tv.kazoom.com is where you need to go. Nice, easy mobile app as well. Easy registration process, you can keep up, choose your table, watch any one you want. You've got 16 to choose from at the moment. Actually 20, I'm sorry. Yeah, 20 tables in use, I think. Mm. This is a huge swing here, instead of 5-1. We're looking at 4-2, Mark. Just by hooking himself on that last eight ball, Petri. Yeah, that will hurt. 
That will hurt. Eight ball goes down. Five two. And we're going four for two. two. Four, four two. two, sorry. Back soon. Welcome back. Genosato Yoshioka breaking off 4 2 down. Oh, he break different strategy. Well, our friend and colleague Tim De Reuter is in action at the moment. He's playing against Vincent Fakay from France. And the horseman <laughs> is in the lead. He's got his nose in front. He's 4 1 up. got a couple of Dutchmen on the production crew. The production Dutchman. Talking about production, this is awesome here. What do you think? Speaking of it, the work they do, endless hours. Just from morning until night. Nice putt there, long one. Opening. That was a really good shot, that. That's probably the most difficult one he's going to have to face now, if he can, can keep that cue ball under control. Mm, he's moving quickly around the table now, Mark. Huh? He knew there was a big swing. Could have been down 5-1, looking at being down 5-1. Petri was running out. Yeah, as we say in England, it's put a pep in his step. Looks a different player, doesn't he? Mm -hmm. Nine. He wants, he wants to draw it where he puts the cue there. Play position for the nine. He went, for, he went the other way. I like that. Keeping it simple. No traffic. Eight ball. Not in its normal kind of position kind of made hard work here see uh, mark because if he was going to play position for the nine it's easy for him to get position for the eight by making the four 14 last now he's gonna be on top maybe top on this ball and he's needs to get a play a good position here yeah he's got to be careful of that three ball Yep. Doesn't want to go near that. At the same time, he need, he want, you want to have a really easy eight ball as well. Some right English on this and it'll be fine probably. It's about as good as he could have wished for. Yep. That's perfect. And it was a missed eight ball, well a missed position on the eight ball actually, by Petri Mackinnon, which is the reason that this is going to be two in a row. 
for the man from Japan. And in it goes. 4-3. Mm. And break in. Well, if he can break like that again, Marcus, he could be level. Yeah, he, he, could broke, be he broke softer on, on the second ball, I think. From yeah, the side. We saw Filler break in yeah. second ball yesterday from the side. He broke very well as well. Yeah, he doesn't he doesn't have that power that's needed to break from from head on. So he's selected to break on the second ball. Which can, you know, as long as he make a ball, he'll he'll be happy. The matches keep on coming and coming and coming. There's no rest for the wicked. Pake pulls one back against Tim De Ruiter. Elliot. 4-2 now. Your Elliot Sanderson, is eight, he in action? Eight, sir. He won 8 nothing. Wow, that's a good result against Oglesby. Sean Oglesby from New Zealand. The Screamer. That's his nickname, The Screamer. Yes. He was disappointed yesterday to lose to Jeff DeLuna. You commentated on that one. Same break again, look, lost the cue ball. Cue ball going in the same ball as where he made a ball. Put through the ball in hand. He got ball in hand behind the, the lines, let's say. Another yeah, game. interesting. Ball in, you know, you get ball in hand, but it must be behind the kitchen. Play up the table, off the break, after the break. I was once playing in a tournament in Bangkok in an eight ball tournament. Same rules. My opponent scratched on the break. I played my shot. I wasn't really aware of it. I didn't play a lot of eight ball. I ran the rack and right at the end somebody said, you played the wrong way after that scratch on the break. Mm -hmm. And I said, why Why didn't you tell me? And they said, well, because we just realized. So I said, well, come on then, we'll play the rack again. And it was a deciding rack and I ended up losing it. <laughs> no, Yeah. you're too nice. I'm too nice. Yeah. <laughs> That's his fault. He should have said it something when you- It is his fault, but what's the, it's only a game at yeah, the end yeah. of the day. And we were only playing for about, I don't know, $200, I think the tournament prize mm -hmm. was so. Uh, right, and I gained a friend actually, we become really good friends. Mm. And he's from France, Kevin Dudek. Hi Kevin, if you're watching, I hope you're doing well. Peter's got some work to do here. I'd rather own friends than enemies. Really? Yeah. <laughs> no, <it's laughs> Life's too short. So you ran a rack of eight ball, huh? That's pretty good. I've run a three pack before in eight ball. What English eight ball? I, or I, think, or you under, I think you <laughs> underestimate, <laughs> underestimate my game. I'm going to have to drag you on the table, teach you a lesson or two, put you straight. Well, three racks in in American pool or yeah. English? American. Nine foot table. You asked Tony Robles if I can play eight ball. Oh, look at this. I wonder if he landed good on this five. I think he might have had a little bit of a result here. No. Oh. Can he slide it down the rail? I wonder if it goes. Does he pass the, the 12? I think he does. Oh, he's looking confident on it. Slide it in off the long rail. Yes. Nicely done. And the eight ball. This is a good finish. Nicely done. Hit it perfect. Down goes the eight and yeah. five three in favor of Petri Makunen. We'll be back soon, guys. Just going to go for a quick one.
we said it wouldn't be long. Just a quick minute. Petri, 5-3. Listen for the crack of the rack. Whoa. Smashed them. I think he made one in both sides. So one minute to have a look around. Yeah, made the ball in both sides there. Marcus, that was a decent break. Really, really hit them. Look at this. Oof, what a good break that was. I'd like to patent that one, bottle it. So it's obviously going to be the 13 ball first. Nine is okay, you can still get on it. Or the 10. Yeah, I like leaving the 10 as my last ball, to be honest. It's nice and near the 9, easy mm -hmm. to get on from the 9. Or vice versa. Probably play the 14 combo. Nice draw shot there. Perfect. He yeah, played that at a good pace as well, didn't he, to keep the 11 there. Well controlled. Get on this 15, then a 9, 10, 8. Done. Mm -hmm. On the hill? No. No? It's going to leave him 6 3 oh. if he runs, yeah. They spread it to a world, let's, let's sign. Yeah, it looks like he's going to go for the, the 9 in the corner after this, and then the 10 in the side, maybe. Lots of whooping and cheering going on around the arena. So the thing here, he wants to... The Cuba is going to tra travel on just a tad. He wants to, he wants it to, s to bounce out of the, the cushion. Yeah, he can just drag this down, can't he? Just nice low on the cue ball. Using the extension, making sure. And just a nice smooth push the nine into the corner nice well lead. played mm -hmm. he's a nice cueist isn't he mm -hmm. plays a really good game I remember when when he won the World Cup pool with with Mika for Finland he played really really good that was, that was his breakthrough. The Iceman. I think before that event, he's never reached top 16 in the Euro Tour or European Championships. And then he stood there as a winner in the World Cup of Wool, which is amazing. Great stuff. 6 3. Have you ever played a World Cup of Wool? Oh, yeah, many times. Have you ever won it? No. Quarter final was the. the Who deepest. did you play with? I play with a guy from uh, Sweden. His name is Thomas. Oh, Thomas, yeah. No, Storm? Yeah. No, no. No, you're not thinking about. Storm. Yeah, I played with Tom, but we we lost twice, first round. Very short race, that isn't it? Mm. Race to but five. But it's a, it's a it? great tournament. It's a fun tournament. Yeah, yeah, really good fun. When yeah. you play scotch double and. I've been to it. I went to York Hall and watched it. Mm. That's a great little venue. That is very famous boxing venue in Bethnal Green in London. Another really famous venue is Alexandra Palace, where we had the Moscone Cup last year. It's going to be in Bally's Casino this year, and I was having a word with Margaret Fefilova this morning. She's going there. She's looking forward to it. Before that, they've got a w, another WPBA event going on. In Vegas? Or I can't remember where she said it was. Let's have a look at Petri's break here. 
wonder if some if someone in this building breaks harder than this. Tell me who it is. There isn't. There, I don't think there is one. Made a ball again in the side. Did he make a ball in the side? Right. I thought he made a ball in the side. Obviously not. Oh, the dejection. Close. Oh, I thought that went. That 15 ball it didn't go. Close, but no cigar. Saw it on its way. So you sure go with a chance. Not an easy one. Kind of tricky little layout here, uh, Mark. I think the 11 is causing problem for the for the stripes to be easy. Let's see what's what is oh he, he might play the 10 here. Yeah, he's gonna give this a really long thing. He's just taken another 30 seconds, so he might as well use them. Or he can play solids. I think he's worried about the the one seven, isn't he? Where does the one go? Where do you make the one? Doesn't go past the seven. Doesn't go past the eleven, obviously. Where do you make it? He's going for stripes, though. Nicely. Oh, brilliant shot! Yeah, opened up that straight away. When the 15 goes past the 7, it's, which is great. Just figuring out the table. 14 will go, which would of course open up the path for the 9. Not the 9, sorry, the 11. I'm having trouble reading these colours, Mark Marcus. 15 in the side pocket. Yoshioka with a good chance here after a dry break from Petri. Could be going all the way this. Tim De Reuter, 5 3 up now mm. over Vincent Fake. Wojtek Shevchek, 5 2 up against Huikata. Kind of falling out of line here. I mean, I mean yeah, this is the too much angle on the 14 than he wanted. It's gonna run into his 13. Put a bit of pace Could on it. Really. Get it off the rail again. Watch out! It's no good. Oh, can he cut this? Can he make it off the eight? I think he can make it off the eight ball. He can. Nine ball off the eight. Got straight in even. gone wrong mm -hmm. so he's facing a tough shot here on the 12 yeah, in 12 the corner the route does the does the 13 bank no he'll shoot the 12 and then save the 13 for last he have to you know much choice he shot So opportunity for Petri now. Well, yeah. I think he went, wow. Can't believe that. Petri making up his mind what 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 bowls is he gonna pick in what order? He's loving this opportunity, isn't he? Picking yeah. the, si the sitting ducks. He won't be. He won't be playing that three ball anytime soon. That's for sure. Oh, he might have to.
to now after this five. Finish a bit straight on this one. Come up two rows. Biardo on the hill, 7-4. Mabuhai. Would be nice. Do you think he can win, Biardo? He, he obviously he can. <laughs> he won a couple of days ago. The Predator Billi Pro Billet Series Temple here in Puerto Rico. Pocketing 25,000. And if he wins this, he'll make 60,000 and win the world title. Making 85,000 in, in, in a week work. Petri. Beautiful. I think Petri is playing the, the better patterns in 8 ball, I think, than of these two. Yeah. I mean, this is master class there of how mm. to run a rack when your opponent <laughs> has missed and it goes beautiful now he is appreciation from the crowd on the hill 7-3 now for Petri Matkinen I've been to Finland many times in my life I lived in Estonia for eight and we're going to go for a very quick break from the big man from Finland, Petri Makkonen. He's on the hill here in Puerto Rico, San Juan, at the World 8 Ball Championships. With me is Mark White. Hi. <laughs> so, if you haven't seen a big power break, check this out. Boy, oh boy. Maybe dry again. You need to go and work on your break, Petri. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's too. You no, know, I'm. Why doesn't he break from the side or something? Why doesn't he change the for, the, geez, for a man that breaks so big? He's had a lot of dry breaks, hasn't he? Maybe it's too hard. So he doesn't. He, yeah. he, he didn't get the spread he wants. Yeah. It could be too hard, you know. How crazy it sounds, but it, it could be. Mm -hmm. Maybe she takes some take speed. A bit off. Yeah, a bit off. I think. You know, I've just had a thought. That's where a speed gun would come in handy because if you know you're braking at, let's say, 20 miles an hour, just for a number. Yeah. So you're braking at 20 miles an hour, you're not making any balls. Then you brake again, maybe try and brake a little bit softer and then see 18, okay, and then you can get that feel and you, maybe you could judge it yeah, like that. Yeah. When could, I used could when become I, a training tool. When I used to play, I used to try to judge the speed I, of different tournament, different break. You know, sometimes you need to add this, this, the power, and sometimes you need to take something off. Interesting. So this rack, obviously, is very important for Yoshioka. Stay in the match. Can't afford to. Oh, not get out. Biado is on the table on the hill. Oh, 
the other table av available on Facebook. All the others available. TV.kazoom.com. They've produced a really nice new easy very easy to negotiate app. Mm. <laughs> I mean, when he's in <laughs> and playing quick, he looks Good. okay, you know. It's a nice little stun shot there between yeah, those but balls. He landed a little bit awkward on the angle, though. He'll leave himself a tougher eight than he want, wanted his final. Roll it, roll it in. It's not like he can't play. It's one of the big players from Japan. 7-4 is the score. And the round of applause you can hear is from the table next door. Carlo Biardo has just beaten. Kitty Kitatani by eight racks to five. Filipino superstar. Yeah, he's having a good week, isn't he, at the moment? Mm. People lo love him around the Filipinos. We want to say hi, shake his hand. Ninja Turtle is in the house. He's got lots of fans, hasn't he? Wojtek Shevchek, 6-2 up now in his match. Tim De Reuter has gone 6-3 up in his. And another person 6-3 up. One of the juniors, Payne McBride, leads Faris Almadan by six racks to three. Karl Naderberg from Estonia is 5-4 up on Derin Asako Sitoris. I'm really having my pronunciation abilities tested here this week. You're doing well. With all these players from many, many different countries around the world. Yoshioka is hitting the second ball here. Different. Come up dry. Yeah, it wasn't a really good hit, was it? Doing a bit of hip English, <laughs> a bit of <laughs> he needs another 15 to fall in the side there, but didn't didn't work for him. So Petri mm. with a open shot. Probably gonna pick the high and uh, the solids. I would think. This one ball? No. Nice yes. Shot. Big battle going on between Switzerland's Michael Schneider and Canada's Stephen Holem. Schneider 6 5 up in that one. Esteban Robles from Alpha Coin is. Playing a lot better than he did yesterday. He's 5 1 up against the Indian Alok Kumar. Mm -hmm. There's our other sponsors Madaya Light, Alpha Coin, Predator, of course, the main sponsor for this one. It's the Predator World 8 Ball Championships. Jam up apparel. So let's have a look here. Four balls left, and obviously the eight ball for last. Making sure how he's going to play these.
hit three. Four ball next, and then the seven. Speed here, play the angles. It's all about speed control. He doesn't like it, he wanted to be further up. Yeah, he'd love to get this finished now, wouldn't he? He doesn't want Yoshioka winning this one let's and then breaking. He, let's see if he goes back. Excuse me, Mark. Let me see if we go back and forth or. Oh no 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 <sighs> no! Point Dexter. The TD got him. The t the point of the of the side pocket there. Oof. Look at this. Great shot though to get it out, oh. and it's got him. He cannot see it, and for the second time in the match, he's hooked on the eight ball. Well, what does he do here? He's got to go around two rails. Two rails and make the eight. Maybe three. Maybe catch the third rail. Like this. Mm. Oh, it's a good hit, but not good enough. And, well... Oh, opportunity here. I've just seen a panda <laughs> walk into the arena. <laughs> it's Mario Heat. Going to start his warm-up match warm up for his match oh Petri will be fuming in his chair in the corner I mean was that unlucky or was it a bad shot there he is look seems pretty calm This will be a real steal. What if this is going to cost him the match? He'll be sick. Yeah, if you he, break you know, and run threes from here. Yeah, it's possible. <laughs> huh? It's possible. Yeah, it is. Of course it's possible. Anything is possible. He'll be sick. Wow. What a turn of events. Might even be a little timeout for one of the players after this wreck. He needs to run this. Fell short. Mark? Yes, yeah, fell short. He'd take the ah, one on the side, okay, yeah, though. It's yeah. okay. It looked different, doesn't it, from that camera angle yeah. from the overhead. Looked like it might be a little bit thin, but it's not. It's fine. The thing about him, he, he doesn't have the cue ball on the string. It's like he... He is play one shot at a time, see? It feels like, you know, watching his patterns. Like he don't have... But he shoots so good that he just get the job up anyways. You see, he fell out of line again. Yeah, this isn't ideal. You need to play the patterns well in eight ball and play the angles. And this is missable. Oh, uh, well Nicely done. Nicely done. Yeah. Eight ball left. It's going to be 7-5. Just when you think it's all over, it's not. Oh, he's missed it. Oof. Oh, I thought he'd missed that. Uh -huh. <laughs> How wide did that go? <laughs> oh. Overcut I'm it. I'm having coronaries here. Mm. Oh. Some tension in this match, isn't it? Huh? I think this is far from over, Mark. Now, yeah. yeah. I mean, twice. He's breaking. He's hooked himself twice now. Petri. 
yeah. on the eight ball. And he's taken advantage of it both times. Yeah, and as you say, if he can run a three pack now. Petr will be sick. Oh, I wouldn't want to be anywhere near him <laughs> if that happens. I'm steering clear. <laughs> You're steering. A crazy fin walking around the venue. One way to describe these guys from that part of the country, uh, from the world, are uh, he's passionate, right? There's plenty of passion in those guys. Mm. Mika, well known for his passion. Still playing well, isn't he? Player of the decade, mm. 2010. From 2000 up to 2010, Mika was player of a decade. That's a big title to have, huh? Wow, yeah. That's... <laughs> yeah. Come up dry, though. Oh, so, Petri, a chance. Again. Mm -hmm. What if he can forget about what happened, the, la the last chance he had? Ideal, is it? One of the four passes. If the four passes, it's huge. It's a big difference this rack if the four goes. I think he wants to play a combo, but I don't know if it's on. No, it's not on. Otherwise, you have to break it up. And three's definitely on. I think he's going to be going for the three here, surely. No, no, no. no sorry, not the five. Yeah. Sorry, not the three. The, the five. five or If the four goes, he's gonna, he's gonna play it now. If not, he needs to. Yeah, the referee will be. If having a look at this one. If he's not, go if he's not playing it, he doesn't go. That means that means he he have to break it up. So he's looking at six, I think now. Petri. Doesn't long six then. Trying to redeem himself. Oh, confident shot. shot, nicely played. The seven. I think he's trying to leave himself a good angle on the seven to make the seven, and the cube is going to run into that four ten. Is this the moment? Do it off oh, the oh, seven. Oh, oh, whoa, oh. whoa, whoa, whoa. I was going to say, Oof. is he going to go into it from this? He's on top of that eight, I think. The mark is the tad. Yeah. Makes the only it more good difficult. thing is he needs to play a little bit low on the cue ball anyway so okay, he's all over the place in the seat there good nice shot he moved it but i don't know it's enough whoa 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 for the one well if he hasn't mate has he got the angle here to draw off the one or is it too thin he's sick look at his body language oh he double kissed it well it could bank the the four, if he can get on it in a decent position, a cross corner. I wonder if he can make the four or bank the four. Yes, yeah, and bank the four. Play wow, safety. Wow, he's played safe. Okay. Yeah, he'll be sick. Well, he's left the ball over the side pocket here. I think Petri, at the moment, is mine. He can't believe that things are not. He's this not, not shake his corner. shake his hand and safety, which is not bad. 
pet. You're probably gonna kick this softly. Kick this the four, so it's tied up still the ten four. Obviously, it's a big advantage for Yoshioka with all them stripes left. He's he's got so many options. He's called it five ball. Oh, wow, yeah. he'll settle for that, <laughs> won't he? That's lucky. Oh. Ooh, he almost grabbed ball in Almost hand. picked the ball off. Well, it was a good hit. Well, that's interesting because the referee oh, wow. has stopped him. Watch this, watch this. Oh. He wouldn't have ball in hand. Petri would have. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. I agree there. I'm sorry. I agree with that. That's not the. We yeah, have Petri is in the right here. And Petri is right. How can how can the referee influence a player at the table? Obviously, John Lehman is. He wanted to be nice, but he's not supposed to say to the players. I think it was just a gut reaction, yeah, yeah, you yeah. know, to, oh. uh, uh, you know, yeah, yeah. you know, you see what I mean? Just yeah. to, you can't help it sometimes, it just happens, right? Wow. Big moment, though. Oh, yeah. Wow. Opportunity. Drama all the way to the end here, Marcus. Oh, look at that look. I hope he never looks at me like that. Well, Petri, Petri yeah, told the to referee that he was in the wrong as well. He's he did, yeah. He made a, one of the stripes. He's just lost the. He's just lost the. Uh I think Petri is playing a lot of good shots at the moment because he's leaving the one by the, the cluster of balls. Just in case uh, he's got a shot, he's got an opportunity to, to break him up. Ushioka playing safety. Yeah, he wants him to get that four out of the way, doesn't he? But and the one in the corner. Petri doesn't want to come off the back of this and disturb that. He won't. Oh, good shot, oh. good shot, good shot. Oh, yeah. Very good shot. Mm -hmm. This is getting interesting here. Because Petri has played a really good speed on that shot to where if he gets opportunity, he can break the cluster up. So we should play Just a nine a in the side. It's nine in the side, I think. Oh, he's played it, yeah. yeah. Does that go past the one? He I needs to figure this out. What about playing it hard off the back of the one? And the one ball or going he, across. Or he can make his one, shoot the 15 into the one, make it and draw it. Watch out. Oh, oh, oh. Petri's called the one. Well, let's see the angle. Let's see anima angle. animation here from the players. Let's see the angle on this. He's playing it off the four. Off I think. the four. Just graze that four ball. Spring it out. Oof. Well, it's on now, though. So <laughs> Yoshioka has to be very, very careful now. I'll have to think fast as well because we we got a shot clock. Yeah, no extensions left. I don't think the 10 goes. That's okay. Shoot 13. Then the 14. <laughs> Try and leave yourself an angle on the 11 to break out the 10 ball. Is he thinking of doing something here? It's 
safety. Hook behind the eight ball. Mm -hmm. Oh, this has turned into a real battle. <laughs> Petr is called the one. Three rails. Yeah, round the back of the 13. And this one is pretty big to make if he hits it. It's a big chance. The 13 ball. It's a, it's a big chance he Bottom can make rail, it. Side rail, just before one, the two, side pocket. Three. Has he got it? No, but he made contact he made with the four. contact fourth. and made a rail. It's okay. Yashoka won't try to grab that cue ball again, though. <laughs> Will he? <laughs> like he did last time. Tim De Reuter on the hill against Vincent Fake. 7-4. Shevchek through, 8-2. Safety. We're still no nearer to knowing who's going to win this one here. Hmm, Petr, what is he? Looking at something interesting here. One ball in the corner. The Z shot. The Z shot. Oh, oh what, what a great a shot that is. Well played by Petri. That was great, wasn't it? Yushoka, he's trying to squeeze him. He's tied at 10 4 up again. I think that's it now. Ball in hand. I see what Joshua is going to do. Snooking make. him again. I think he's going to make his one ball. Same time, snooker. What has he done here? Oof. Whoa, he's got away with that. <laughs> he can't <laughs> believe <laughs> it, <laughs> Petri. <laughs> he's thinking, what have you done there? That could how have did been you get away, away with it? That. How about the, look at the, how about the two <laughs> railer in the corner? Look at Petri. Two railer in the top left-hand corner where his arm is. Oh, he's gone for the other bank. Oh, he tried to make his 14. Oh, what a shot. Oh, he oh. almost made it. Whew. Another opportunity here. Well, for you, Shield. I think this is the most interesting wreck of eight ball I've seen you so far. Opportunity now for you, Shield, again. He wants to play safety again. He likes to squeeze him, doesn't he? Yeah, he is. Look at this. <laughs> yeah, so he's called. Wonder if this is on. He's gonna play one rail here. You see, one rail kick with a with a tad of high yeah, with left hand English. Yeah. Look at this. Watch shot. this. This could be another great shot. We've already seen one from him kicking. Come Look on, Petri! Oh! How can you hit that <laughs> and not make it? <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> oh, he's absolutely sick. Oh, my God. Absolutely sick as a dog. Look at this. Wow, if Petri goes on to lose this match, I don't know what I'm going to do. He needs a timeout, though, after this. 
Yeah. He's going through <laughs> torture here. <laughs> Calm yourself down. Well, it looks like it's going 7 6. And if you're Petri Mackinan, I'll just go out the arena for a, a couple of minutes. There was a lot of things happened in this wreck as well, you know. Oof. The referee got involved. Petri didn't like that at all, you know. And he's it, right on the eight ball. It's going to go 7 6, and he'll be breaking to go hill hill. In it goes. Oh. <laughs> he made contact with that four and didn't go. That's such a great shot as well, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Timeout? Or yeah, we'll have a timeout. At yeah, least. he's taking a timeout. So we're gonna we need one as well. Yeah. Petri's over there talking oh, to him. Oh, he's talking to him. Let's put a mic on there. Why did we get involved in that game? We shouldn't have said anything. No words from John. Yeah, I think that's... Oof. This is a, this is mean, a the, tough the, one the, to the swallow. The ruling is a referee must not help or encourage a player in any way whatsoever. Yes, yeah, the players were also responsibility to it's know the rules. Responsibility. But when I saw it, it's it was just like a gut reaction. Of course, yeah, yeah. And Petri there talking to his friend about it. Tom Lamanau is there. Yeah, the best thing yeah. he can do, I know it's the hardest thing to do at the moment, but the best thing to do would be to just try and calm down uh, we're gonna go. We need a break, guys. Well, we've calmed down. Hopefully, Petri has as well. We're free, John Lehman. Placing the cue ball for Ushioka. And would you believe it, uh, Mark? 7 6 already. He was 7 4 up with chances. Hooked himself again on the eight ball behind the point to win it there. Played a brilliant, or a couple of seven brilliant in the shots. Side. Seven is gonna not fall. No. Opportunity for Petri. Oof. I wonder where his heart rate is at the moment. So many things happened in the last wreck. How has <laughs> that seven not gone in? It's a good view. That seven don't wanna fall. Which leaves opportunity for Petri. 
Come on, Petri. Yeah, he need the solids. Now get rid of that six ball now. Yeah, I'll, I'll play the six then the seven. Six, seven. The eight ball goes in the corner, so he doesn't have to remove the the eight anything. Flicking the side of Keep the rail up for the up three. For the three, yeah. <laughs> you okay, mate? You okay, Mark? <laughs> oh, just so much happened in that last rack. I think we need to put that up on the oh, page okay, for all it. to see. Again, that was brilliant, wasn't it? Nice shot there. Didn't want to nudge anything, and he didn't. I think Petri wants to leave the two for last. So you have a natural angle for him to move, move the cue ball over for the eight in the corner. You don't want to have don't straight. Don't go in. straight. Don't go straight, Petri. Yeah, he just lost the cue ball slightly there. But look on his face. He's, he's pretty straight on this. Can he just force the cue ball out a little bit? Drew it you don't want to two be top in the, of the side. Ten. He's Oof. okay. Drop this in. The tumble is kind of <laughs> shooting the two in the, in the side. I think instead. Yeah. Using the extension. He's is not. He's thinking of paying the five. Is he? Composing himself. Two in the side. Big ball. Big shot. Yeah, huge shot this. He's missed it. Why so hard as well? Petri He's having a nightmare at the moment. There on Mackinnon mm. Street. And then Yoshioka, who with opportunity. Not not the easiest of all. Work to do. Nine and ten or uh, nine and fourteen, excuse me. Not. Come for the 11. Whoa, that's <laughs> not good. It's not good. Petri got the will 12. like that. He's got 12. Oh, he has got the yeah. 12. Daniel Maciel, runner up in the Puerto Rico Temple Open. 7 2 up on the hill against Gerson Martinez Boza. Well, kept the bank the 14 here. Yeah, or he'll shoot going. the 13, then the 9. Well, we'd like to be a little bit closer to that work. Back and forth, maybe shoot the 11 next, or the 14 in the corner. Pass the eight. No. No. 
Now then, Petri, here is a real, real chance. Turns away from the table, knowing he didn't play a good shot to get on that, did he, on the nine? He was a long way away from it. All right, Petri. I wonder if he's straight on this two, then he shoot the five first. And it's a travel. He wanted more angle. He's okay. He would love some more angle, and then he could play two rails. Now he'll, he'll have to punch this in. Don't hook yourself on this. Don't hook yourself again. He has just got it. I'm oh. sitting right in line, and I think he just is on it. No extension left, I yeah, think. Yeah, checking the clock. He's got about 15 seconds from now. Oh, I think he makes this. It's in. In it yeah. goes, and finally, Mackinnon across the line. Breathes a sigh of relief. We'll be back <laughs> very, very soon, guys. <laughs> we haven't got much of a rest. Marcus Schammer and Mark White will be back very soon.